Hey guys, it's Wandering Aquatics, and uh, we got you today the printer tank package of shrimp. I call it the printer tank because, of course, you have this. You have the printer right here. You have the tank behind it. Therefore, it's called the printer tank, and the things that go in it look like they came out of a printer. Because we got crystal shrimp. We got black crystal shrimp and white crystal shrimp. So, we got your printer set up. Alright, let's get to it. see these skills here with one hand. Not buying got skills, I'll catch back up with you. Alright, with this video here is why we didn't get the normal Tuesday video. So I was waiting for this. And let's see what we got in store today. Alright. So the first one. All right, take your guesses right now in the comments. Which one will be first, black crystals or the white crystals? Take a guess. All right, guess it's over. Mm -hmm. yeah, things like never ending. Just gonna keep rolling. Just keep rolling. Hot. There they are. The gold bees, white crystals. I'm not sure how they define them. If they're the white bees, you. I mean, yeah. Gold bees. They look kind of golden, these ones do. Or white crystals, but they look like golden bees. But these ones actually really help if you mix them with uh, red crystals and black crystals. It helps bring out the uh, white in their coloration. It makes them look really nice. Oh, these look beautiful. They're really gold. But I'll get these into a container and uh, we'll get going. Well, We'll just put those aside. Rock the blacks. So yeah, those are the shrimp that ran out of ink. Funny, right? Funny. There's your music for the day. All right, there they are, the black crystals. Man, that one actually looks kind of blue. Wow. Tell me that's not blue. Hold on, focus. Focus. That looks so blue. I mean, that's awesome if they're blue. I love that even more than black. Those look blue. That is awesome. I didn't think they came. Maybe it's just the bag that's doing the trick on me. If I can focus, sorry about that. But they look blue. That's awesome. The printer only had blue ink. <laughs> Look at all those babies. Alright, can someone explain this to me? I have blue parents, right? Blue, plant, blue parents. And I have red parents, right? Red shrimp. How do we get orange shrimp out of that? You see that? That one's orange right there. The one that's to the bottom of the screen. It's orange. Not red. Not blue. I've never had oranges crossed with these reds. Never once has an orange came into touch with them, and they've gone through tons of different babies before, but for some reason, I have like a batch of 10 to 15 oranges in this tank, and it's the weirdest thing ever, and I can't like figure out why there's so many oranges. There's another baby right there. Yeah, all the shrimp, there's like 15 orange shrimplets in there, but yet I don't have any orange parents in this tank at all, and they've never came in contact with my oranges that are in this tank. Which babies for days. Shrimplets. And albino koi guppies. Beautiful. Alright, we'll catch up to you when we get them into their container. Alright, here we are. Um, I want you guys to vote in the comment, se comment section below if uh, you think they're blue or you think they're black. I mean, they look kind of blue to me. Maybe my eyesight's a little off. Focus. They look blue, but I'm more okay with that. I actually might try to select breed to get that bluer come more out in them. So less black, more blue. So that just looks awesome. There they are, all happy as can be. The golds look really nice. They're big. Some big boys and girls in there. That's a big female right there. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna put them in their drink, 
drip acclimation. Man, I cannot speak today. Um, but yeah, I'll get that all set up for them, and uh, we'll get them in the printer tank. Can we talk about just how ghetto this system is right here with my drip acclimation? I mean, look at it. It comes... I mean, that part's not ghetto. That's the cool part. But then what's holding it? A trash can. It's low set get. This thing's kind of low set. It's not a really good spot to do it. So, I mean, gotta do. We'll find our ways with it. I mean, it works. It works. Yeah, we'll let that sit for about an hour to two hours maybe three who knows we'll see all right we'll catch back when they're in the tank get some cool action shots all right so here's a few days after in their tank and uh that blue hue that they had when they uh came in is completely gone and so now they are black as can be but they still look awesome and the other colors are really strong nice and dark and the white ones gold bees doing pretty good those ones came in a lot bigger than the uh, crystals did and this dumb leaves blocking the entire tank of course you know so that's what leaves do they block um, yeah, there's another one right there focus 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 it's not focusing but yeah so they're all doing good all running around See if we can do an aerial view. Of course, now that thing reflects. Awesome. It's not one thing, it's another thing. Alright, so I moved the leaf out of the way so you can get a better view. And, uh, you know, of course, we have special guests in here. See if I can find them. Now he's hiding. All right. Oh, there he is. I him right back. We got an endler. Uh, one of them happened to somehow get in the tank. Probably came in on a plant or something. But there's an endler in here. The last of my endlers. We still have one. Yeah, they're all doing great in here. They're all loving it. I know some hide in there. A lot of them just go under there because I really don't have tons of hiding places for them right now. Um, I want to add in some charla wood to it. Give them a lot more hiding places. A lot of them do hide around the back. There's around 10 shrimp in here, about five and five of each. Maybe one extra of one kind, but yeah they're all doing good and uh I would also like to add though that the shrimp I mean Flip Aquatics does an amazing job with keeping their shrimp just so healthy when they get to you and I mean I just like to give a huge like kudos to them on their system and how they do it and it's just like always amazed me how healthy their shrimp are and just makes me so happy when they come in because I hardly if anything have any losses at all and my shrimp always do really good So yeah, there's the printer setup, you know, I like it. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next.